You were the star of 2016. I mean, I remember you scoring the goal that, that, that got you into that uh, semi-final and, and into real contention. Then, of course, you managed to get yourself all the way to the final. Mm. But unfortunately, Stefano, this is something that Indonesia does quite a lot right in this competition, the history of the competition, getting to the final but not winning it. So in 2016, did you guys think, yeah, yeah, we can win this one again? Yeah, of course. Uh, you know how it is with Indonesia. Like, like you said before, uh, five times runner-up. Um, yeah, so every tournament we are willing to, to, to win the tournament, same like in 2016. Uh, we had a really good tournament and um, we made it to the final with Thailand and then in the final, in, in, at, at the end, we lose uh, against Thailand. So uh, again, we were runner-up. So it's, it's a little bit painful to say it and to, to see it every time, but uh, hopefully we can make a change this, this year. You see, I, I'm not going to make you talk about this one because it's probably painful for you, Stefano, but Roshan, you can talk about this one. If you look <laughs> at that, five-time runners-up, they've dared to dream so many times. I just wonder why they haven't got anything other than a zero in that winner column. It, it's been, a, to be honest with you, it's been a massive mystery to me as well, JD, about why mm. they haven't been able to take that final step and win this competition. Because for me growing up, and I've followed Indonesian football for a while now, and especially on the international stage, when you think about Indonesia as a country, yeah. when you think about the talent that they have available to them and the kind of players that they, they yeah. develop huh. um, in that country, you always feel like, why are they just a step short when they've got a competitive league at home. Mm. They've got good players coming through the ranks. They've got the best it's crowds. Always, best got crowds the best around, crowd. arguably. And, and, and the football, right? they're, they're football crazy. They're passionate mm. About, mm. About, about the game. So it's always been a little bit of a shame for me that they haven't been able to just take the next step and progress and win the competition.